super successful game day, obviously. Then I just baked some cupcakes. It is time for bed. I obviously have my skincare on my face. It's probably like a little damp from moisturizer. And then I have the Laneige lip mask on, but I did a little reading, a little crocheting, just things that I don't get time to do during the week. I love to do on the weekends. And then tomorrow I'm hoping to bake again. Good morning. It is Sunday now and I just finished a chapter of the online course I'm taking in Python, so I'm tired. <laughs> I had an English muffin for breakfast and then I painted my nails all Valentine-y. As you could probably tell from the Valentine cupcakes and the Valentine tree, we are all in on Valentine's around here. It's not even February yet and we are full force ahead, ready for it. And today my plan is to just kind of relax and get going on some of my New Year's resolutions. So one of them was to paint my nails every week. So we're doing that. And then I want to read 12 books. So I actually already finished a book this month, but I want to finish another one before Nightingale comes in the mail. So I ordered Nightingale for my book club. That's what we're reading for January and February. Normally we do a book a month, but Nightingale is over 600 pages, so we decided to give ourselves two months because we all work full time, and that's a lot to accomplish. So I just kind of want to finish the book I'm in the middle of before I start another one, even though I'm also in the middle of Midnight Sun because I just can't get myself to get through it. I also was crocheting yesterday, which I want to finish that blanket. I've been working on it for four years. Like, I am not kidding you. I've been crocheting the same blanket for four years and I'm fed up and I'm going to finish it this year. And I also want to finish the cookbook that I started last year. So I'm a little over halfway. I have 45 recipes left. I definitely have the 45 recipes that I wasn't as excited about. Um, I accomplished the ones that I really wanted to do last year. So it's going to be hard to push through with that, but we're doing it. And then I also want to do yoga five days a week, which I've actually done yoga every day so far in January. I haven't done it yet today, but I'm sure I will. And I'm doing it with my parents, which actually makes it a lot easier because I feel like if I wasn't, I would just turn off my alarm every morning it went off. But knowing that they're like waiting for me to do it with them helps me keep going. Also, I just wanted to give myself a little shout out. Look at this little, like, ignore all of the, like, headphones and stuff down there. But this little thing from Hobby Lobby with my candle wick trimmer and then these two candles. Like, is that not adorable? So, so cute. This is from Hobby Lobby. This is just from Amazon. This candle is from the, like, dollar section at Target. And then I actually um, made this candle at one of those, like, lab things. So, so cute. I'm super proud of myself. And then I also, I'm in the middle of like redoing this section. <laughs>
and in the end of the vlog, I kind of let my hair go natural. I didn't realize that if I didn't comb it out so aggressively after I took a shower, I've actually got like a little bit of wave going here. So this might be a new hairstyle for 2021 and no effort, which is fantastic. I just read like 200 pages of Majesty, which is the second book of the American Royals. I think that's American Royals, American Air. I think it's American Royals series, which is so, so good. Definitely recommend. And just did some cooking today with my mom. We made vegetable soup, which I will not be partaking in, but I like cutting vegetables. And spaghetti, which we had for dinner. And just a really quiet end to a weekend. I have work all week this week, so going to bed early. It's about 9.30 now, so just going to do some skincare and go to bed. So thank you to everyone who made it this far in the vlog. Make sure to subscribe and like this video. Thanks, guys.